Hello, everyone, and welcome to the very first episode of Kronos Blindly Plays Persona 5 Strikers. Now, this was the winner of our latest community poll. Unfortunately, it was delayed a little bit due to me getting sick and then losing pretty much a lot of time trying to catch up. But yeah, now let's go ahead and get started. I just launched it. It says, no, no system data found. So let's go ahead and create that. I haven't been to the options yet or anything like that. I couldn't know if I... The only screen I saw. I was told that I shouldn't watch the intro because it's a little spoily, so I'm just gonna press start until we get to the main menu. That is extremely colorful. Uh, is there anything that I want to do? Audio seems fine. Let me know. Uh, audio output. What? Oh, for surround sound. Yes, English voices are fine to me. Uh, you know what? I was told that the, the mixing's not that great for uh, voice and audio, so I'm gonna I'm gonna move that down just one for now. We're gonna see how that is, um, and then hopefully the audio, the the voiceovers are above everything else. So confirm, yes. Display settings. I think it should be like. Yeah, it should be that right now. 60. Yeah, we're good. I might change the full screen. Doesn't look like anything's being cut off, so it should be fine. Uh, graphic settings, everything's on high. Is there higher than high? It's custom. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I, I don't know what that means. We'll just stick to high for now. All right. Uh, yeah, and start. <laughs> uh, Persona 5 allows you to experience the game with English and Japanese voice. I'll stick to English for now. That's what we played Persona 5 and Persona 5 Royal with. I was chuckling at Yusuke with uh, a, a, an ice cream cone. A helicopter shadow? I guess that's not that out of the ordinary. It's definitely unique looking. You just grab onto. Oh, I thought you grabbed onto like the minigun. Like, I know it's a magical minigun ugh, and everything like that, but at the same time, I'm pretty sure it would burn your hands. Okay, so that didn't change it to a Persona. Are we just fighting Shadow Shadows and not actually Persona Shadows in this? I know it's kind of like Dynasty Warrior-esque like battle system. That's kind of a puny knife dog. Uh, you know what? That would have been a great opportunity for you called out a knife. Oh no, those are they are Personas. Let's begin the operation. Okay. That was one hell of an entrance, Joker. Thanks. I love him. Everyone else, proceed as planned. Attack? Attack. No, that's jump. That's attack. Wow, you guys are way easier than like the nightmare, maniac, whatever the hell mode it was in Royal <laughs> that I played. Then again, that mode was actually pretty yeah, my special's a gun? That's a horrible special. In the world of magic and shadows, what is your special ability? Ability, I bust a cap in their asses. Uh, showtime. Okay, show's over apparently. No, it's not. They're here. Achievement. It's showtime. I like it when the game just gives you an achievement right off the bat. Makes me feel f special. Hi, Joker. Is this the intro that I was told not to watch? I mean, they're kind of playing it as at the start of the game, so... Oh, Fluffy! Should I close my eyes? Hey, that's my phone. Don't throw it around. 
Don't go to the gallery. You broke my phone. You know how much phones cost? That's... We're not friends anymore. That's not true. You look like a young... A very young Zodro. That's a weird outfit. <laughs> oh, that's that's a snazzy outfit. So I'm, I'm assuming I'm, am I gonna be able to change personas in this? Like, I mean, on a wild card. Oh, we'll we'll just wait and see what uh, what's what, right? Uh, hey, it's been a while. I know. It only feels like that because you always forget to reply to our texts. Wait, really? Um, I mean, I just got a lot of stuff to do. That's not true. I suppose it's a little. While, it's been a little while for me too, hasn't it? For me as well. I have no money, so I lost service. Oh my god, dude. Really? Uh, how is everyone? Oh, you want me to press a button? I'd say I'm doing well. It's quite late though. Shouldn't you be oh, studying for your finals? Absolutely not. Nah, I'm like Ry I'm fine. I'm like Ryuji. <laughs> stop, stop. I'm already dead. Anyways, here's what I really wanted to say. Since it's almost summer vacation, why don't we get together? That's never that never ends well for the Persona groups, does it? Not a bad idea. Yeah, you guys want to go on a trip? That sounds like fun. Perhaps Kyoto. That would be a nice place for a vacation. No way! Kyoto's <laughs> trips are, all, are for high schoolers. Futaba, aren't you going into high school or rejoining high school? Sweet! We should get together somewhere and plan this out. Where at? Where else? Uh, let's meet at the hideout. Roger that, leader! Uh, certain police department meeting room. Oh god, am I gonna get drugged again? And next on the agenda is the series of incidents involving unusual behavior in public. Hmm. Is there any way that I... Now, that's skip. I was gonna try to increase the audio a little bit. For myself. Uh, it's not that bad over there. You know what, let me... Which is the Corona's supposed to cut this out in editing. I yeah, know, I'm just gonna jack it up to 30. Yeah, all right. Now, let's see how that sounds. Hmm. First, we have the vice minister. A little vice. better. As you're all aware, he had some sort of episode during a diet session Q&A and abruptly confessed to document tampering. Good. Hmm. Not gonna lie, for a second there, all the way back here, I was like, is that Sai with new hairdo? And it's clearly not Sai. Soon after that, three Sapporo Central Councilmen confessed to bribery and publicly resigned. Next, the well-known author Mr. S. He held a press conference and announced he was retiring from writing, returning his book's awards, and deeming his body of work garbage. I mean, okay. Then, a newscaster suddenly got down on one knee, confessed his love for his co-anchor on live TV, proposed to her, and got shot down. That's hilarious and very heartbreaking. Lastly, the Director General of Criminal Affairs unexpectedly stripped off his clothing and ran around HQ until successfully detained. Alright, so for a second there, I was like, okay, it sounds like someone's doing like what the fan thieves do. Getting people to confess their crimes. Then this is just not what we did. <laughs> Something amusing to you, Inspector Hasegawa? And the naked guy running around. Uh, no. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> the vast majority of these cases have been interpreted as nothing more than bizarre outbursts. 
But time and again, every instance involves a sudden change in personality. Furthermore, none of the individuals involved had any known psychological issues before their incidents. Or are they just good at hiding them? Therefore, we can surmise that these cases are the result of an external influence. A wumble. Aren't these just coincidences? Are you really implying someone out there is using mind control? We like to refer to it as like changing their heart, but sure. The cases I listed are only a small sample of this behavior, which appears to be happening across the entire nation. Hmm. Sounds like the Phantom Thieves to me. I mean, it's not, though. You can't be. We're retired. I want silence. Proceed with the report. Thank you, Commissioner Kabaragi. As you've realized, or at least as one of you realized, these cases are very reminiscent of last year's change of heart epidemic. The top brass have concluded that this is indeed the work of the fantasy. But it has, it has no similarities, though. <laughs> Aside from the first two that were clearly criminal, but then when you get an author saying that his work's garbage, someone getting down on one knees and proposing to a girl that don't they don't like, that the girl doesn't like them back. I mean, that's not really us. What? Hmm. But what evidence is there? No one's even established a pattern. And we don't have any sort of motive. So far, doing it for kicks is the only thing that'd explain it. Yeah, maybe. You will investigate each of these incidents yourselves as quickly as possible. What I expect from each of you are two things. One, to assemble enough evidence for a successful case. Two, to do so as quickly as humanly possible. Wouldn't they already know about me though? Didn't I confess? Or did they cover that up? The higher ups are hell bent on closing this case. I do not know why, it does not matter. All that matters is producing results. I remember I turned myself in. Well, I was caught for one. And then I turned myself in after we saved the world, the right? Suspect is the leader of the Phantom Thieves. Okay, so they do know it's me. Show me a thorough investigation of his entire life. <sighs> so, the Phantom Thieves rise again. Woo, Monday. Just like today. Been a while since we rode this to Young and Jaya, huh? Uh, now for today's train news. Today's headlines are: Confession of document tampering. The diet is in chaos over the vice minister's finance or confessions. The power struggles are have flared. Members of the vice minister's party have refused to comment across the board while the country awaits his court summons. In business news, fledging IT company uh, Madice reported rec record first quarter profits at the conference earlier today. Medici, his earnings have exploded largely in part of the new virtual assistants, which, if stocks are any indication, is gaining fans fast. We're almost there. We haven't seen everyone in so long. I know it's stupid, but I'm getting kind of nervous. Yeah, I, I, am I dating everyone in this in this game, or are they just gonna ignore that? Uh, this is gonna be awesome. Yeah, when the Phantom Thieves come together, it's never anything less. Ooh, we finally made it. Do I have like an official name now or am I going to name myself Alex Noah again? Hey, hey. Uh, uh Yojin Jara, we may have been gone for only a half a year, but it sure brings back memories. Okay, let's just get the LeBlanc's post haste. I wonder how the chief's been doing uh, get, getting along. I thought that guy just waved me. Uh, to progress the story, head towards the area with the icon, sure. No. Uh, do I have a menu? I have a pause screen. I have a map screen. I have a camera button. Hi, I would like to buy secondhand mm. stuff. Nothing? Alright. Vending machine? Mm -hmm. Wait, is that a talk? Uh, tobacco. I thought. My mind went to like three different locations there. It's like, taco machine? Tobacco machine? Is that still. Do they still have those? Let's go. I know they used to have cigarette machines way back in the the day when I was a kid, but those got like 
mm. shut down pretty fast. Well, here we are. Doesn't look like things have changed. Kind of looks like you got a new, like... What is that? Tent? Not tent. Umbrella thing? Whatever the hell that is. Okay, let's go. Then again, it's been a little while since I played Persona 5. A little dusty in here, huh? Hi. Oh. Surprise! We get you or what? <laughs> <laughs> we missed you. I know. I'm pretty awesome. It's been a while. Did you get taller? <laughs> Looks like you've been doing fine. I love the jacket, Makoto. You too, Morgana. Mm. Meow. <laughs> it's gotten hot. All of you are you some nice coffee? Hey, for you guys hungry? Oh, Mona's practically purring. Hmm. <laughs> Boy, were you surprised. You guys did all that for us? <laughs> Talk about a greeting. I mean, kind of expected something. Kind of looked like this place wasn't open for a while, though. <laughs> we hadn't seen you in so long, we knew we had to do something. We figured the best way to get you was to have Boss let us in early. Well, you're looking sharp. Thanks. Uh, Did you get even older? Of course you did. It's been six months. Uh, how have you been? Too bad. Uh, I'm sure you all have plenty of catching up to do. But I gotta open up soon. Go ahead and take it upstairs. After all, it's your room. Have a good time. Is my stuff still up there? Uh, thanks for hosting again. No problem. I do look a little taller. You're not wrong, actually. You can just pay me back working the counter. Oh, God damn it! Deal. Now, thieves. To the hideout. <laughs> Great. Just when I was enjoying the peace and quiet. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> though. Well, never fails to just not as really cluttered as it was when I was <laughs> living here. <laughs> finals in one day, too. Really freaking out. Really, Ryuji? I had so many makeup lectures in a row, I almost wasn't able to come over today. <laughs> then I win. I only flunked one final. Good God. You two are the same as always. Can't you at least take your classes a bit more seriously? You know, wait till you graduate, maybe? Ooh, watch out. Miss President's gonna unleash her fist of justice. Jeez. Will you please forget about that already? It kind of seems like you're taking more after your, your Phantom Thieves outfit over there, Makoto. So is college life all it's cracked up to be? Yes, it's going well. I've been using the time to take care of the core curriculum. I've been busy too, but it's also a lot of fun. For example, I've learned how to selectively breed certain vegetables. Neat. Oh, -ho. yielded any results yet? He just wants free food. Boy, <laughs> that got his interest. Did I? Yosuke, did I call you Yosuke earlier? I'm gonna call you Yosuke. Wait, aren't you in the management program though? Yes. But students are allowed to take courses beyond their own programs if they feel so inclined. They even offer agricultural science courses. You can learn all sorts of neat things, like the correlation between soil nutrients and yield. Gah. That'd put me to sleep in a minute flat. All right, well, you know, you don't have to say that out loud. It's kind of a dickish. And you, Fataba? How's school been for you? <laughs> Too easy. At this point, the only hellish parts are the commute and PE. Are you going to do a different school? Because the commute wasn't that bad. PE for you, I could imagine being pretty rough. You just got to do cardio. Uh, that's pretty impressive. So you've been working hard. Um... Uh-huh, uh-huh. Praise me more. Keep it coming. <laughs> well, how about you then? You're the one we're most curious about. You doing okay back home? I dropped out of school. I also missed you, Ryuji. Oh, okay. I, mean, I guess I missed all of you. Well, I've been getting by too, but without you around, it's sort of like stuff is just kind of bleh. I do liven everything up. You're right. Of course, he's our leader. It's only natural.
control. That's right. Uh, I'm blushing here. <laughs> Once a phantom thief, always a phantom. The SWAT team just busts in. Well, Utabi, your posture is gonna just be destroyed by the time you're twenty. Stay here through all of vacation, right? Well, how about a trip, guys? Come on, we've got a whole month to rage. Um, aren't you forgetting about your homework? <laughs> <laughs> not only do you have homework, but your third years now. You need to start thinking not just about graduation, but post graduation. Yeah, start being an adult. Yeah, no, stop. Don't bring that up. Not now, please. <laughs> Ryuji never changes. Back to the topic at hand. If I may suggest Kyoto, I'll find an abundance. Why do you sound so quiet over there? That's weird. He's sounding way quieter than everyone. Else. I know he has. He's soft-spoken, but still. Dog, I actually can barely hear you. Something wrong with my setup? Like what the hell? Yeah, if it's a month-long art tour, I'm totally gonna pass. A trip does sound nice, but what if we all went camping first? Sure. We can all go hiking and stuff during the day, and even throw together a barbecue at night. B -b barbecue? Aren't those always the big gatherings for people who socialize IRL? Oh, you'll be fine. It's just <laughs> us. Sounds fun. You can leave the firewood chopping to me. And, you know... The body chopping as well. Kicking summer off right with a barbecue buffet sounds badass to me. <laughs> How about you? Uh, don't forget the veggies. Let's go all out. Um, let's go all out. Look for decent marbling in the cuts. That's how you get the real good stuff. Trust me on this. He's a cat. He knows. It does sound rather fitting for the summer. I like the idea, but we'll need an awful lot of vegetables to balance it out. Huh. A barbecue is one of the few things in this world that could pull me away from art. Oh, Hell, maybe even a steady income could pull you away from art, dog. Choosing food over art? You sure your priorities are solid there, Inari? All right. Our first reunion party has been unanimously decided. We're going camping. Woo. And with that settled... Emma, list recommended camping gear. I have compiled a list of items recommended for camping. There was a sporting and travel goods store near 705. You have in Siri? Shibuya. Customer reviews rate this as the best relevant store in your area. Ooh, what's that? The virtual assistant, Emma. You haven't heard of it yet? Oh, I think I have. It knows, like, basically everything and does all sorts of stuff for you, right? Yeah, like record your locations and send it to the government. Got this uh, eye that thinks for it. Right? I? I think you mean AI. Oh. <laughs> right. It stands oh, for artificial man. intelligence. I know what AI means. You can search all kinds of databases, conduct navigation, manage your schedule, even talk out logic problems and stuff with you. The makers go on about how you can ask it anything and you'll get the best possible answer. I remember seeing a demo of one on TV the other day. They were showing off its functions and talking about how it's the next big thing. Brock Lesnar? Yep, that's it, all right. Pretty solid tech, considering it's roughly a thousand times smarter than Ryuji. That's not much of a comparison, though. Or, like, an accomplishment, I should say. Shut up! That sounds kind of cool, though. <gasps> I bet you can tell us where all the best ramen shops are. Yeah, you should all download it. I'm telling you, it's the bee's knees. Is this how we get all our information stolen? I see. I suppose it'd at least be handy if we ran into any trouble while camping. This is assuming you actually get service out in the woods. That's a good idea. Why don't you get it too? I delete some porn off my phone. Hello. This is Emma. That was fast. I'm pleased to meet you. Please provide me your name. Oh, cool. Uh. Oh god, you gotta use a keyboard? Alright. Wait, do you want first name first, and then... I didn't say first name.
Is this gonna be okay? I mean, I guess it really doesn't matter. In, in yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Now I gotta get. I'll stick to normal for now. Cause honestly, I uh, I have never played. Uh, well, okay, I played a little bit of like a Dynasty Warriors game way back in the day, but I I don't I don't really I'm not really good at those types of games. All honesty, apparently I have a uh, a trading card. I imagine uh, this can be changed later. As long as we change later, that's fine. Well, I mean, if it can be changed later, let's start off with hard then, and we'll go from there. I mean, like I said, I don't really play these types of games, so I'm probably gonna get my my shit stomped. But, well, uh, yes, sure. Thank you. Again, I am Emma, your helpful virtual assistant. Hi, Emma. Looks like you've got it figured out. I literally just downloaded it and entered my information. I sent you all friend requests. Please don't blow them off. Please don't blow them off. Aww. Decline the friend request just to see what happens. So Emma came up with all that? Impressive, no? And it's not just random junk for sale either. It takes into account the season, the weather, your personal profile, and even your location for all its recommendations. For real? Damn. That thing's eye is crazy. Close. You get close. Ugh, AI, not an eye. Well, should we split up and buy everything Emma's listed for us? Oh, can't we do it tomorrow? It's so hot out. I bet this guy's beat from the traveling too. I'm fine. We just went through all the effort to meet up at the hideout, yeah? So let's make the most of it. Indeed. I have an absolute plethora of discussion topics for us to mull over. Oh, great. Particularly matters such as modern art and the possibilities within it in our current age. Look, if you want me to pose nude for you, you gotta pay me. Yeah. Anything but that. <laughs> we had a great time catching up together. Treating us all to curry, boss. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Just think of it as sort of a welcome back gift. Plus, with this guy hanging around again, it'll be nice feeling like old times. Same here. <laughs> Thanks again. We'll be back soon. I would imagine we'll be back tomorrow. Well, see you tomorrow. Yeah. You know, it was nice talking after so long. I know, right? It's like you guys should have came back with me. Okay. Let's get to shopping first thing tomorrow. Yeah, we gotta get everything Emma listed up. I like Futaba's right? duster too. Then we should trench coat, whatever. Statue in Shibuya. See you then. Don't go forgetting, okay? Getting what? I wasn't actually paying attention. And don't go forgetting about helping out behind the counter either. Oh, that's yeah. never happening. I was a bit rusty at first, but it, I helped out around the cafe before returning to my room. I'm exhausted for all the excitement today. Let's call it a night and get to some sleep. Of course. Uh, saving. You can press Y to save, apparently. Okay. I'll just add this. Well, let's go ahead and do that. Um, I'm not sure how long these episodes are gonna be. You know? I know it's not as long as, like, the, uh, you know, Persona 5 and Persona 5 Royal. Um, but I also don't really expect to have to cut too much from this this game, right? I know in uh, Persona 5 and Royal, it was, I would cut random battles that I had already done before, right? So, I don't know if that's gonna really apply to this type of game. I'm assuming it's probably gonna be more like when I play like Dark Souls or something, where it's just all combat's gonna be in all the time, unless I keep dying over and over again, then that might be like a death montage. I think for now, we'll, we'll keep it at like 30, 35 minutes, and we'll, uh, we'll go from there. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next episode. Have a great day.